Hi, this is Lucky Smith, and I'm at Maxwell Dixon's our event with Jaja. Jaja, um, where can people find you at? You can find me at Raleigh Film Studios. Okay. Um, you can find me online at www.modernfineartentertainment.com. And what is it that you do, Jaja? I'm a filmmaker and a painter. Painter. And how long have you been painting for now? I've been painting actually for 20 years professionally. And um, five years I've been painting with the Chicano Art Movement, which is very big. It's Chicha Marina. How did you um, get started into art? I uh, started into art when I was very small. I, was, I always loved art. Um, I was educated in art. I was very gifted in mathematics and science. So I excelled at those things. And when I got bored, I just always, my mom always told me to have do not let your gray matter idol always work. And where are you originally from? From Memphis, Tennessee. Memphis, No art studios. Um, I actually went to school in um, Wilmington, California. Okay. High school. Um, 4A school, mostly football, academic school. So I excelled in academics. But um, I took a back turn. I actually twisted my ankle because I was only 155 pounds. Oh, wow. Running tailback. And I bench pressed like 350 since I was in high school. So what I did was, you know, to take my unidle mind to work, I always did art. From my mother. And what makes your art unique from everyone else's art? Well, my mark, my art is unique because I patented my art, which is made of diamonds, rubies, sapphires, emeralds, 14 karat gold, platinum, emeralds, and cotton and linen canvas. And what made you decide to paint with diamonds and rubies and gold? Well, well I was I was doing a lot of oil painting. Uh, when I was hanging out with the Channel Art Movement, okay. and they kept, you know, like undermining the art world. So I took a gamble and decided to. I got my brother, who was deceased, Jeffrey Johnson. I got and we patented this idea. We looked online, we patented the idea of putting gems and precious stones on canvas. And after that, it was history. And then uh, all of it shut up. Go ahead. And I'll shut up on the stock market. Oh, oh I thought you said, I'll shut not. up. I'm like, but no. no. Shut up. And so. So gold is like, gold right now, when I did it, gold was at $450 an ounce. Yeah. Right now, gold is fluctuating between $1,700 and $1,800 per ounce. Oh, God. So it's expensive. So it's what's expensive. the price range of your artwork? So, uh, so that way, readers can have an idea. I mean, if you look at the price range, it's, it's undescribable. You know, it can be whatever you want. Commission work, I love that more than anything because people get to pick their stones, they get to pick the market price for the gold, and then their stones. So I take them out, deliver it to them, and then I actually do the work. Oh, so work. you have paintings where if I come to you and say, I want you to paint me, you can paint me in diamonds? Yes, commission work. Um, the linen and cotton thing, cotton diamonds on campus um, since about 1994. So you've been doing this for a while? Yes. And then you also said that you're a filmmaker. Um, what role do you play in making films? Um, well, I do uh, independent films. I've been to Africa, Ghana, West Africa. Okay. I've been to um, West Indies, and I've done a lot of stuff on culture, culture okay. and heritage. Okay. So, that's what it's supposed to spend at. So you do mostly independent films and so what is your next project? Do you have any, any upcoming shows? Yes, I do. I have um, up and coming shows which I produce at Raleigh Film Studios. Um, that's right, 5300 Melrose Avenue, right across the street from Paramount. Um, also Paramount's going to do some shows also there too. Actually, a lot of studios. I've been in the film so long. And I started out doing voiceovers for Nike, which were, which I don't know if everybody's familiar with Nike. Nike commercials mostly was basketball, was 
be bopping and beep, 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 yeah. beep, 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 beep. And that was probably like maybe a decade, about a decade ago. Oh. Not a decade, I'm sorry. A century. A century. And who are your inspirations, your influences? My influences? Um, jazz. That's my influence. I like to paint the jazz. So you're listening to jazz and you just paint away. And I paint away jazz. I, I love. Um, I love relationships. It makes me. Fun. It gets my mind off relationships. I get someone new. It's beautiful. You know what I mean? Yeah. With the heart, they have an enduring heart. This is not the outside view. This is the inside view. And can people find your artwork at any galleries right now? No. Or? Everything's on because the cost. And then also, last question is, who's your favorite artist out there right now? Art, my favorite artist out there right now is probably uh, Jeff Koons. Jeff Koons. And is there any other aspects and of the art? Reason, oh, the reason, the reason Jeff Koons is my favorite artist. I like Damon Hurst too. The young British artist, they're okay. good. But the only thing about them, they have other people working for them, which is good. And it's because it creates jobs, but um, and they don't do a lot of the creations. It's most of their mind. But I like those artists because that's where I want to excel to, to produce jobs in America. So you want to become a name? You want to become a brand name? Yeah, exactly. All right. I will go ahead and upload this. Thank you very much. And John, you're working people find you out. Facebook, Twitter, website. Oh. Yeah. Master Artist Jaja Gerard Johnson at Facebook, www.modernfineartentertainment.com, and Raleigh Film Studios. All right, thank you very much.